Send us golf shoppers. <laughs> hey there, this is the Pink Chronicles Chapter 3. And today it's a very special episode. It's a, it's a very special episode. Stop the drugs! No. Uh, Pop the bills off! Stop the gobs. Pop the gobs. <laughs> anyway, We're Matt. learn how to do that. <laughs> I'm yeah. from you! <laughs> <laughs> Today we are going to be looking at Matt's extensive Power Ranger collection. He has a big Power Ranger collection that he wants to show us. And uh, it's huge. It's the huge. biggest, <laughs> it's the greatest Power Rangers collection. <laughs> it's the most fabulous. I'll tell you, they will pay for my Power Rangers collection. <laughs> Mark my words on that. Oh my god. I swear. Oh, I just got it. You did? Yeah. <laughs> well, I couldn't, we couldn't be more obvious if we'd use the puppet. For the <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Anyway, welcome to, <laughs> to the Pink Chronicles Chapter 3. Uh, today we are going to be looking at Matthew's Power Ranger collection. And uh, you're going to see Wes probably coming in begging for candies to be sent. <laughs> Please send me golf shoppers. Gobstoppers, the immortal so gobstoppers. We'll be right back with Chapter 3 of the Pink Chronicles. Hey there, welcome to the Pit Pin Chronicles. Today Matthew is going to show us his Rangers of Power collection. Yeah, I want to do that. You sort of position yourself in a way that you're just not here, Father. I'm here. I'm, I was trying to like move it so that everybody would be able to be in the frame, but uh, thanks, Father. <laughs> but uh, I don't know. Uh, you just like I'm right here on your like. I'm like the pet. Oh shit. Dad. Ooh. Keep this. Yeah. Give, yes, give it to me. Okay. Get off camera. Fix it. Turn Hello. Off camera. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing <laughs> ever goes wrong on camera. You like, yeah, keep the like most expensive stuff <laughs> off camera and then you knock it off. You put it right at the edge. You were bouncing right around like a five year old. Right See, on the edge. That area you was supposed to be for my stuff. But you've been over there on your iPad. That's because I have nowhere to sit here. <laughs> because you wouldn't move. This is here because you wouldn't move. Oh, now okay. let me get on to my <laughs> collection. Because, good lord. <laughs> doing a video with a five-year-old. Alright, so I'm going to go on my tiny thing first. Which, uh, this is actually my collection of pops. Uh, Ranger pops. I own every Ranger pop that's possible to get. <clears throat> or under... Sixty dollars currently, so I've got a Red Ranger. So is that the original Red Ranger we're looking at here? Yeah, well, um, technically it's the movie Red Ranger. All of these are technically the movie ones, like the original '90s movie. Uh, well, it's still Jason, right? Yeah, it's Jason. Wait, was it Jason for the movie? I don't think it was for the movie. For the first one? Yeah, I don't think it was. Yeah, I don't think it was. Um, I know, yeah, no, it wouldn't have been, because, uh, because the mo Technically, it's Jason, like, because all they did was add the symbols on, but technically it's the movie one, because of the symbols on the Oh, movie. this is the one I recognize. Of course, it's Tommy, he's <laughs> the Green Ranger. He's my favorite. I'm you let a spoiler that people don't know who the Green Ranger is. <laughs> um, the Green Ranger saga is what got a lot of people into the Power Rangers originally. Uh, speaking of Tommy... Uh, White Ranger. The White Ranger. Favorite. He's very shiny. I really like him. Um, I like him a lot. His introduction to the series is one of the best introductions for any, like, Mysterious Ranger. He did a lot of Mysterious Rangers afterwards, but he came at the best for me. Uh, this is Blue Ranger. Uh, this is actually weirdly on. These are on sale for some reason. It's for, like, six ninety nine. That's Billy, right? Yes, Billy. 
Uh, there was never any other Blue Ranger in Mighty Morphin. Uh, so all the figures we're going to see are from Mighty Morphin era, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, sort of. Um, here is, of course, uh, I would love to say Trini, but uh, if it's the movie, it's actually the girl after her, Aisha, I think it is. Aisha. But uh, uh, it's Trini to me, so. Trini was... Um, Unfortunately, the actress that, page, that played Trini died in a car accident, right? Yeah. At a very young age, which is really sad. She's really... I like her. Zach? Yeah. I mean, technically, once again, because it's a movie, not Zach, but still. Zach. So it was in the movie, then? Adam? Yeah. Adam's cool. Adam actually, like, really knows which ones. Yeah, no, he's yeah. super cool. He comes um, back in a later season to help one of the other, like, rangers, black rangers that doesn't really... Have like kind of confidence, and there's this big scene where he comes in and like starts fighting. Yes. Now, um, Kimberly. Well, the curvy ranger. Oh, yeah. Super curvy for like Funko. Actually, uh, funnily enough, there's three of these. You may notice they're all in generic poses. She's thick. Uh, these three are the most recent put out ones of the uh, Mighty Morphin stuff, and they're in poses. Yeah, I noticed. Because there, there's actually I don't own the older versions of these. I don't really seem to see it necessary where these are in the generic poses, because uh, you know with the, they got the cool action poses. Why not? Oh, you might want. oh I almost caused a mistake there. <laughs> well, I gotta put these places because I'm taking out like I, I don't want to redo them. All right, so that's the end of my uh, my original Mighty Morphin. So what are we uh, going to now? The movie. Mm -hmm. The movie ones. Movie Billy. Uh, I actually really like this movie. I don't remember if I said so or not. Excuse my nail polish, it's all cracked up. Uh, I, I actually do like the way their heads look. How do look. you feel about the new suits, you know, the, the suits? diverse suits? Um, some people are like really like, oh, I hate it, I can't believe it looks like that. I like them. Uh, I, I really respect that they kept, like they could have just went full, like whatever with it. Yeah. But they kept a lot of elements. Like, like you know what, I'm going to do this because I really like this. If you look at the visors, they've got certain similar elements. The, the things coming down here, the general overall shape of it, the, uh, just like, the sort of, like, the top, like, the tip sort of coming down area, these are, like, same. I'm going to do that with all these now. Um, we've got, uh, Trini here. Um, with Trini, uh, you'll notice that, uh, instead of the two things coming down, we still got two silver parts right here to uh, sort of represent that. You even got like the sort of like right here, there's sort of like a jowly sort of thing for the mouth that's also reflected here. The eyes are reflected in this right here. Um, they don't have the ears, which is upsetting, but I mean, like... Someone on the inside. Is there a secret surprise that he's out of training? Something's inside training. <laughs> What's in What's inside Trini? Weird. Yeah, something's in training. Um not touching. <coughs> Next. Yeah, she's a she's a lesbian in the new movie, actually. Is she? Uh, did he yeah. actually fish it? Like, yeah, yeah, it's referenced. Good. Someone uh someone asked her if she has boyfriend troubles. And she says a couple things and, like, looks away and then says girlfriend troubles. And she talks about the fact that uh, her family wouldn't be able to accept it. This one's going to be harder to point out because, uh, very black. Um, whereas, like, here you've got, like, the tusks of the Mastodon. This one, they've got the little hints of the tusks of the Mastodon. You've also got, like, the trunk area is basically, like, it's a little bit more angled and stuff here. But it's the same as it comes down, like, a lot. Um, the shapes are generally kept, and that's what I really like about these new suits. Like, people are like, oh, it's so different, so strange. But, like, it is different, but it had to be different. But well, did the new, did the new Zach and the, and the, did he do any cool, awesome breakdancing moves? You mean, uh, what was it called again? Oh, God, what was it called again? No, when the actual character Zach and Peebster Zach did the breakdancing. Yeah, I so. know, but he had a word for it. Yeah, I know, but still. Like, no, he didn't, but I'm trying to think of what the word was. <clears throat> Probably the most loyal to the original one is uh, the Red Ranger. Red Ranger. 
honestly. Like, you can really see the shape is, is very much the same. Uh, it's still got the eyes right here. Or rather, right up here. You can't really see there. So, like, you've still got the eyes. You've, you've still got the hints of the silver for the teeth. But uh, it's not all over this time. Because it's not as, like, blatantly like a dinosaur. But I love the fact that they do keep the shape. That's that's what that's important to me. So you ever notice that in the series, like, Red Ranger's, like, touted as kind of, like, being the leader. <laughs> and there's, like, a bigger focus you put on the Red Ranger or when they originally do, like, the other series. But when you're actually talking about Mighty Morphin, it's, it's actually, it's really, like, the, it's the, like becomes the Tommy show. Yeah. And the Red Ranger kind of almost falls in the background. The movie does a much better job of this. I really like the Red Ranger in the movie. Like, he's really cool. No, we don't even meet Tommy in the movie. Nope, he's just in it up. I'm sure Tommy will be awesome in uh, the next film. All right, um, this one's a weird one because it's got like the biggest head of all of them, but uh, it still it keeps things. Like, see, this one comes this comes back into a point at the end. This one comes up into the point. Uh, it keeps like a good portion of silver, which is cool because this is a good portion of white, which is uh, funny because at being the only girl ranger in the Sentai, this is the one that had all the huge white and everything like that. Yellow isn't a girl in the Sentai. Uh, you can see that it keeps the heart shape to the visor. It's just, like, I really do respect how much they... How much work they, you put on it. Yeah. Like, I, some people really don't like the suits. I like the suits. I, I think they're fine. Uh, could you put these somewhere? I'm running out of places. Oh! And now for my last little thing. Um, and that is the special <coughs> uh, Muddy Morphin edition of oh. these things. I love these. They're supposed to be I'm like to the camera, that's mid morph. This is Red Ranger. Uh, he's he's awesome. He looks awesome. Okay. Um, Trainee here. Still got uh, all I like the, the see through part. Of it, yeah, Tra I love Trainee because she's very see through. Um, you can probably see my finger like three or five. Um, it's really 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 nice. I love these. Uh, the moment I found out about these, like they were instantly pre ordered. I love this smoky. Glittery, black. Uh, black. This basically, oops, this basically looks like my eyeliner. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, it's really nice. Uh, it's blue again. Let's see, oh, no, bring it up. Let's, let's uh, see it because it's really cool looking. It is really cool. I haven't given this enough of a attention. And this is just the this minor portion of my collection. I'm putting blue with the blues over here. It looks cute over there. It's like all the blues. And uh, I actually do like pink too. And pink does, in fact, still have the skirt. So a little see-through skirt there. That's cool. It's real cool. Like, I love these. You can see, like, there's detail. You can see the belt. There's a morphine still there. There again. I'm it's it's impossible for you to see it from here, but, like, you can see the belt is still there and detailed. So and, they actually uh, put a lot of work into it. They didn't just yeah, you shove can... a mold out there. Yeah, exactly. And I really like that. <laughs> um, I will say... I used to probably go back into the bag now. But uh, I will I'm say right that... Uh, <laughs> yeah, that... A lot of this stuff is going to be... I'm surprised you didn't bring over your uh, villains. What do you mean, my villains? Did you have, like, villain ones, too? Like... Of the pops? Yeah. No. I don't have... The only... I have the... You mean the tiny things? Oh, okay, yeah. I have the tiny things, but I don't have them over right now because there were so many of them. And I, like, we were in a bit of a hurry. Uh, and honestly, like, I was like, there's too many tiny ones. It's going to be, like, a mess. All right. I should have. I might have brought in one because I like them a lot. We'll see what's in this bag. All right. Uh, I got these pretty recently, actually. Oh, these are the plushies? These are the plushies. I love these. Um, so, but make sure the camera can see them good there. Yeah. There's the trainee plush. These all go in my bed, by the way. Like, every single one of these. <coughs> Zach plush. Zach plush. I really like these. These are, like, nice plushies. They actually put away the plushies for you at the EV Games. They did. Uh, he buys a lot of the stuff at EB Games to the point now where he's bought everything that they've had and when there's something new they alert him right away and they actually yeah. put stuff away for him. I own everything that they can that they sell. Uh, when it comes to Power Rangers. <laughs> everything they sell. I own all the I games. I own every video game ever made. <laughs> uh, this is actually the first one I bought because it was payday like like the next day I think it was and I was like oh, I don't have the money <coughs> for like $100 of these right now. Uh, and I was like, I'll buy this one. And they're like, put away the ones, that you, the other ones that you want. Uh, and you got the next one. I just, I literally picked all of them up and put them down. I was like, I'm going to get these tomorrow. So I got this. He's my favorite, of course. Um, oh, I see another one that would be my 
My favorite. I'm gonna bring it. This is the White Ranger. I love the White Ranger. It's so cool. And the way he's introduced into this into the series yeah. is like he's he's kind of like it sounds like he comes down from like an angel. Yeah. From uh, from above, it's actually really really cool. And uh, here we go. Billy, little Billy, still with the symbols on them, which like is is directly from the movie, but that's fine. Uh, oh, no, forgot. Oh. You forgot. I forgot him. He's Jason. Uh, all these go on my bed. Like I sleep with these. So, um, collection's not as huge as you'd think. Mostly because it's a lot of big, like items per se. If I can put these down here in your other box, I think so. So you're not gonna uh, take them more room. What am I gonna do next? Figures? Yeah, figures. Sure. You have figures? Yeah. I do figures? Where's this sword go? That's in here somewhere. <coughs> this is. I love the six and a half inch line. I'm gonna pull, pull this out and put this in the holster, actually. Uh, this, so, this is a famous Green Ranger, right? Yeah, this is the famous Green Ranger. I love Green Ranger. The, the six and a half inch line are my favorite because of how poseable they are. Uh, I used to. Four. I, there's. Looks like there's a lot of articulation with these. There is a lot of articulation, a lot of posing. I had this on top of my Godzilla at one point. Uh, let's see, like he can move his Mac. And he, he's really good. Kind of reminds me of those Marvel figures that you said from Tybus, those really articulated ones, like the Spider Man. Thing. Oh, yeah, they're, they're very much like that. This is why, like, you were telling me about the five and a half inch lines with the <coughs> original triangle boxes, and I'm like, I like those. Yeah. But these are my favorite. Because these are well, the those five-inch lines are the, are the original way. The <coughs> yeah, they're the original way they came out. But I, I love these. Yeah. Uh, take this switcher. Um, okay. This has nothing to do with figures, but I also have this here. Oh, that's nice. A little uh, samurai one. Gold samurai. Probably McDonald's. So I don't know. I got this at a uh, Value Village. And got this movement thing. Got a couple more somewhere. Uh, I didn't bring all of them. So this is a Samurai Ranger? Yeah, it's a Samurai Ranger. He can move like this. Did you ever check out to see what, what uh, McDonald's tie-ins are actually were for the Power Rangers? I've seen a couple. Like, nothing insanely like I need it. Um, I'll take these guys out as a, as a team. Because I have them in here as a team. Uh, we've got like Rockin' Hard, Red uh, Red Ninja Storm, with his... <coughs> so Ninja Storm, are we looking at the Saban era right now, or are we looking at like the, uh, the kind of the Disney era? This is Disney era. Um, really, like, these these guys had good suits. They had great suits. Um, so bring them forward, so, you know. Show in your collection, really show them. I know. I just like admiring them sometimes. Um, he comes with uh, the sword, and <coughs> on his back I have the hilted sword, which doesn't make a lot of sense, but whatever. Um, I think he's scratching his back. This one. Oh, my back. <laughs> he's got it as if he's taking it out. This is uh, yeah. yellow. Male yellow, might I add. He, he looks really nice. I don't have the hilt on for him. Uh, this is female blue from Ninja Storm. Wow. Yeah. They're really, really nice. They're like really good pose. This one has so, do you know what company actually uh, did this one here? Or? Uh, yeah, of course. This is uh, this is all Legacy line stuff right here. Okay. These are Legacy. So, who figures. does Legacy though? Legacy, legacy is uh, Bandai. Bandai. Bandai, Bandai, okay. Bandai of America. <clears throat> uh, now, uh, yeah, I'll show this first. Oh, speaking of which, um, excuse me. But it starts. Ninja Sword? Yeah. That's its sheath. Ninja Sword. Um, <coughs> now, yeah. probably like some of the steps falling out here. I'm going to bring these like axe figures over here so that you can actually live more room. Yeah, I forgot to uh, bring the accessories with her, but her accessories are Blade Blaster and... Oh, this is the original? Yeah, this is uh, Mighty Morphin Pink. So put it up forward there. Everybody's going to want to the pink one. She's very curvy. Can't really answer. Uh, uh, <laughs> she's extremely curvy, actually. She is. Uh, Amy Cho Johnson. 
bit harder to pose her legs because of the skirts, but uh, yeah. very like good back articulation, very good arm articulation. Well, can you move the skirt? Can you, you can't take the skirt off. Or... No, obviously, dad, you pervert. <laughs> no, I didn't mean uh, it that way. But uh, very good articulation, like really good, very good for posing. Once I like set up something, I'm, I'm going to get these posts. Uh... She moved the camera. Eh? Did she? Yeah, I moved down to move the camera. I feel like a lot of Canadian like TV shows. <coughs> it's kind of like, big series. I just like a slightly, slightly fighting thug. But, uh, oh, sorry. I see. Uh, yeah, really good articulation, really good detail on all these. I'll keep this big right <laughs> here. <coughs> you will not. I had a big crush on Kick Rock. is. Okay, so here's some of the. the stuff that fell out of people's hands. This is uh, the Sword of Evil for Green Ranger. Uh, that's what it was in his hand, so I put that over there with him. Put in his hand, preferably. Um, I'm trying to find the... The thing for her. I will get you with my sword of evil! I had, like, I had him posed pretty well for a while. Um, don't worry. Matt, he'll be back really soon. To show you more results from Far Rage's collection. I'm just... I need to... I want to find the other stuff over for... For her. It's really hard to figure out who the Power Rangers are, considering they color coordinate their outfits all the time. <laughs> Ever notice that? That's yeah, true. Yeah, you right, Power Rangers. They always wear like the like shirts of the, of the color of their. Like, he always wears green. Yeah. And Pink Ranger always wears pink. Yeah. Because <laughs> like Superman, we're always been a Superman shirt. We have any car camp. Mm. <laughs> anyway, but no, small those right. Yeah, she does wear blue and red. What? Red look. He does. Um, everyone in in Smallville is kind of like a Power Ranger in that respect. I'm a sexy ranger. <laughs> All right. Well, it's somewhere in here, but I can't find it right now. Well, Matthew, I'm, I'm sorry. stalling for time. <laughs> no, I'm s sorry. I just uh, I like her gun. She has her gun somewhere in there. Uh, this is in space. Uh, in space yellow. So let's bring it right up there. I want all the in space ones. Wow, yeah, she's, she's like great. In space is really nice. He gave him like, does does the in space ranger actually have a play by figure? Because they do have like kind of a curve. Like... You might be using similar <laughs> figures for, for stuff. Um, and one of the cool things, probably my favorite thing about this, is as you can see, uh, funnily enough, the yeah. Ninja Storm line was only consisted of three rangers, which I have all of. Yeah. Um, I'm a really big fan of the small. Actually, it's really my cool. favorite it's part. Simple. Of the the six inch figures, <coughs> is that when you get all the Rangers from a series? Oh, nice! You have you know like those build with Marvel build with things from Marvel? Yeah, like Galactus you, and stuff, right? Yeah, you yeah. got these. You get uh, their resorts as Obviously. six inch figures. Well, but the Marvel one, we if you build Galactus, we made a cloud. Um, but uh, <laughs> but this is the Ninja Storm Megazord. So uh, when you saw the all the action figure parts put together, right from all yeah, the um, each uh, four. I like the look of that Zord, by the way. Yeah, it's a nice Zord. Uh, for... How to really get that up there. For red, you get the head and the it's torso. Uh, for blue, you get a leg and this uh, this arm. And for yellow, you get the other leg and this arm. And uh, you put them together. Mm -hmm, so and you've there. got yourself a six-inch Zord figure, which is great. So, if you see it right here... At home, I have uh, a piece of the Mighty Morphin Zord, uh, and a piece of the really Space, cool space Zord. <clears throat> I really like it. It's really, really cool. Um, now we're moving on to another section here. Um, my, my collection isn't <clears throat> that, that big, per se. Um, actually, before we do that, I'm going to show one thing that's in my bag here, because like, I brought a couple things in my bag. Well, it's something in his magic bag. Okay, then. Uh, it's not this. Where is it? Here it is. It's Power Ranger This time. is a tinier thing. Tinier thing. Oh, cool. Yeah, it's so cool. So, does that open up and show... Oh, God! These are a bit tight. Oh. So, this is like the... And here's... Here's... Matryoshka. Matryoshka's. Here's Black Ranger. Who's Zack in there? And... <clears throat> oh, what's in that? It's Pink Ranger. And what's in that? Sunny Blue Ranger. And what's in that? Baby, tiny yellow ranger. And that was really cool. What's something? 
What's that? Oh, what's... What is that? It's an itty bitty alpha. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah. Little itty bitty alpha. Oh. Uh, this thing's adorable. Uh, I just realized I forgot to bring my shot glasses. I hey, he has shot glasses of all the, the different colors for the rangers. Yeah. Uh, I didn't bring any kitchen-oriented things. I have uh, three water bottles, uh, a set of glasses, three mugs. <coughs> yeah. I got a I got a couple stuff from that. So it was a tiny thing before I moved on to the uh, the bigger portion of stuff. Because once again, uh, my collection isn't huge as much as it is. It's more quality than quantity, I'll say. And quality is important. Quality is incredibly important. Um, though, I will say, like, I, I forgot it, but I might, uh, if there's like a cut in the video, I'll go get my keys, because I have a lot of Ranger Jeez. keychains as well. Um, and I've actually got some stuff coming in the mail now for stuff. But, I'm going to move on to my next thing. More furs. Uh, I have a couple. That's a morpher? This That's is a morpher. Done. It is, but it's a morpher. <laughs> um, this is the Dino Charge Morpher. Uh, and I know some people will be like, Oh, isn't that uh, Kuru Ranger? No, because this is the English one. You piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I got that's them in cool. here. Yeah, hold on. So. Uh, but that's not all that it does. Like, like you're, you're wondering how that's a morpher. And I'll show you how that's a morpher. Because I've got the dino chargers. Now they're cool. You can press the thing and they do stuff. See that? That's a really okay, cool. So show me the morphing thing. <clears throat> Are you gonna start? <clears throat> okay. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> it is. And that's not the only one I have. Uh, Ammonites. So do, do they come, do you have to buy different ones? Like oh yeah, there's a bunch of them. I don't have that many because that series ended uh, pretty much when I got this. So I'll probably collect them in hindsight. Like I'll, I'll go online and EP, get some. eBay, something. Yeah. Oh, I should probably show this one's thing. This is, uh, <clears throat> this is the Maximum Charger. Which has, as you can see, all of them on it, like all a bunch of dinosaurs. And if you click it, that's the different ones. Let's try that one. So that's this morpher. That's cool. I, like I really like this morpher. Uh, there's a lot of add-ons to that. Um, take this here. While I... Uh, but that's not all that I got. <clears throat> I that's not all, folks. The current series is morpher. I put it together. You did. It was very troublesome. I put a lot of stuff together. Yeah. <laughs> um, this one, before I show any of the other effects... It's like a it. surface type thing. Got that thing, so it's got the blade mode. Um, um, it's got. So this is like the claw mode. It's like this, uh, and bow mode. It's like this. Where it's. Um, <clears throat> so this, what's the new series called again? Ninja Steel. Ninja Steel, yeah. I was a fan of the. I know a lot of people weren't, but I was a fan of the Japanese version. Um, I don't like this more for that much. I'll tell you that now. I like this. Why not? Uh, the reason, I love these things. These are the collectibles. Let's, let's get that up closer. Season. Get that up closer. I'm going to get so. the other ones out. And there, uh, I, I brought a couple to display why I don't like it. To be honest. So this, um, is, the, this is the red. <clears throat> Do you want to put it down that's, there? That's red. Not this one yet. See, this is the red Ninja Steel. 
Uh, this is the generic one you get for them. So what you do for this one, or the other one you sat there, you put it in, and you gotta spin it a lot. Like a lot. Red Ninja Power Star activated. And it made weird, like, <laughs> clock noises for a second. Yeah. And, uh, oh yeah, there's no way to get it out regularly. You have to pull it out like that. Now, what would you expect it to say? I've got the red RPM Ranger right here. What, what would you expect it to say? I would expect to say red RPM Ranger. Legendary I've got a couple red. I should have I should have brought in a couple of my other ones. because uh, I've got other ones. So what's this one here? This one Let's is the S close. This is the SPD team. That's not even the close to the camera. That camera's <laughs> up there. So yeah. So there we go. There's the SPD team. That's, That's the, the SPD uh, team. I love the SPD team SPD suit. Team. What? Uh, SPD team. SPD team, yeah. See them? <laughs> See them? Yeah, good. And it's shiny too, it's really nice. Uh, I was excited. I bought these before I bought the Morpher. I was like, this is going to be the one I collect. Uh, 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 uh. No. Cat, stop doing that. Hey. I'm doing a video. <clears throat> Smoke. This is forever. <clears throat> team. Legendary Team Star. Or just generic. Yeah. You know what's really comical? If there's it in reality, so you know. Yeah. All right. It's morphin' time. You'd be you. You have the crappy idea. By the time you, you turn to can I, wait, don't fight me yet. <laughs> I'm can not I just more. say that the Japanese version of the morpher was a sword. Yeah. Oh. The morpher was a sword, and I'm so like I was super into that. Next. Next. It's cool one. to hold though. It Stop. is cool to hold. Oh no, Justice League. Starro is coming. <clears throat> um, the next ranger in the series <laughs> is Smokey. The Smokey oh. Ranger. I love this ranger. She's fluffy. Okay, so this next thing. Uh, from the from the new movie. It's this. It's the, the movie. Uh, is that the movie more first? Yeah. Uh, turn around. <laughs> so. It's... Here's the movie Morpher. Um, I actually like it a lot. Um, now, I have all the coins. Um, I can put it up. You're not going to be able to see very well. You might be able to see a little bit there. Uh, my only issue with this morpher... Oh, it counts. <laughs> makes some cool sounds, right? Yeah. But the light in back... <clears throat> You don't think the light's strong enough? No, it's not that. See, that was the red star. This or the, the red star. The red star. The red, the red, uh, red legendary ranger star. Uh, this that was the red uh, coin. This is the pink coin. If you look real closely, you can see that the yeah. bigger, the thing's still in it. It's the backlight is yellow, yeah. so instead of like showing off what it is, it's just strong yellow lights. So it overtakes it. Yeah. So the subtle colors, it's just like even if like say I'll skip the other ones because you don't need to see this for everyone, but black, the one that you would think show it the most. Think would show it the most. Um, You can see a little bit more. You can see it a little bit more, but it's really... Mind you, by the way, if you look at these... Oh, very detailed. Like, very detailed, uh... Things. Let's just see if we can... I'm not sure if you guys can will be able to see this that well there, but... Yeah, like, it's your computer. I don't know how you don't know how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. Have you ever seen me on an iPad? <laughs> Trying to find a camera. But there we go. Here's the... So it's... They're actually very detailed. Like the coins? <clears throat> uh, I, I believe they're putting out legacy versions of the coins, which... That'll be cool. Yeah. Um, Maybe that'll change, fix the issue. Yeah, potentially. Um, 
We're getting to the biggest stuff now. We are, because this is actually the last thing in this bag. Yeah, here it is. This is the gun that I was looking for. Hey. That goes in the hand of the yellow space. Choo choo. I'm gonna pop this out of this <laughs> its belt buckle. So Come on now. Jesus Christ. Doesn't it just go in the holster? It can go in the holster or hand. Uh, <clears throat> oh, that's the impressive one. Now we're going legacy. Here is. Uh, you got to do it. Say it. Say it. What do you want me to say exactly? Because there's a couple things I could say here. Well, you, I could say like it's morphin time, or yeah. uh, <clears throat> white tiger zord because that's what this is. This is the white tiger zord movie one. Now this, this is like. This is good. The Legacy series is an incredibly well made, so you can actually tell the difference between holding. By the way, if you hold it, it does that. <clears throat> I'll close the camera. So the tariff? Listen. So this is amazing. These, oh these, yeah, and the there's a good heft to this. There's a good weight. This is a very well made. And the, uh, when he got it, he would like bring it around the house at random times, and just like hold it, and just be <laughs> like, yeah. And so we'll play the song again. Uh, just so you know. Oh, round up. Coins come out. Uh, that is a really nice coin. It's an excellent up. coin. And this is like this is actual metal. This is not a plastic one. Yeah. Just so you know, guys. It actually actually it came with with two coins. I forgot to bring the other one. Uh, that so, one was of the Falcon Zord. Right, so this is the, got the Mighty Morphin load, load one there that side, and we got Ray Mysterio's mask on the other. <laughs> uh, that one's White Tiger. Yeah, I know. Mm. Uh, it's a pity that I didn't have the other one to put in because it's pretty cool to see. Well, this is like the base that it goes in, right? Just like a plastic base that it goes. Well, in. it's not just a plastic base that it goes in. If you look on the back, it's on the belts. Oh, per perfect! I can wear this. Um, it's a pity I only brought one of the coins. It's only I had five other coins <laughs> as a part of the legacy coin set. Now this is impressive. You got to really put this up front. Yeah, this one. Oh, well, these are coming out probably now in a second. So this is a legacy coin set. This this was one thing you bought with your tax money, right? Yeah. You get your taxes. Uh, let's just see the before you do that before you take anything out. Let's look at the artwork it's here. Really nice. Let's see because it's really well done. Uh, it's really nice. This is an impressive. The set. moment I saw it in there, I was like, yeah, I gotta get it. Um, so is this? Uh, have you opened this stuff yet? Or? I have. That's why there's accidentally a tear here because <laughs> something happened. Uh, you don't want to know how much this costs, or are we just not gonna go there? <laughs> Chris, you don't need to know. <clears throat> Uh, now are these metal or plastic? Oh my god, are they metal? I haven't taken them out yet. That's the thing. Like, I haven't taken these out of the, the thing. Okay, so let's but just let's bring them up there. Take a look. Like as good as that, oh my that god. one is, this one is gorgeous. Look at this. That is... That this is, is awesome. absolutely stunning. Like, Did like you, if you put in this comparison, like, to this to this, just feel this. Feel the difference. Wow, these are good. They've got... They've, has a really nice heft to it. Yeah, it does. I love this sculpt here. Raw. And uh, oh. Oh. as a as a like a, does it do different? Like it won't do anything different, but I should still be able to put it in. And that is now the Red Ranger's coin in the White Ranger's marker. Oh, that's. It's morphin' time! Now I can become the Red White Ranger, which... The Red uh, White Ranger. At, in the comics. Me. No, in, in the comics, that actually almost happened. That's the universe that uh, Lord Khan came from. And I can just press the Z button on the back. Reference to mm. G-Ranger. Actually, there's the Z on the back. Um, I could put any of them in there. There's no real reason to. But that is an amazing-looking set. 
it's really nice. I'll put this back in here so I can put it back on. I kind of wish you put like kind of a plush thing to that though because it really deserves it. Yeah, I know what you mean. I might get like another like velvet or something like that. I might like set this up with another thing after. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because these are like these are, are gorgeous. So bring them up close. Bring this them up really close. Out of the set so you can see them better. They're gorgeous. They're really hefty. They're really nice. They're high quality. Um, I didn't have the other original Morpher that it's been like out for a, like, a long time. So are the Legacy Morphers for all of the uh, the Rhythm Power Rangers? Um, there is a reg there's a there's a one for the TV one and there's one for every one of the movie characters. So there's the White Ranger the one only one gets his own type thing then like. No no no. There's there's a red one and a and a blue one and a pink one for the movie. Okay. Uh, red one. Is Legacy version or just regular version? Legacy. <clears throat> It's all legacy. Um, uh, I will say that uh, the red, I think, is currently going for fifteen thousand. Holy crap! Yeah. Red so this stuff actually goes up. No, so let's bring up. Let's just show the uh, the front the front, front box art. Oh. So so something like this. Does this go over? Is this like an over an over under a hundred dollar item? We're talking about it. Right? That's under. That's not that's not bad then actually for this. Here. Um, the last two things that we're gonna touch on here uh, are over. Gorgeous. It is. So which uh, one do you want to see first? Um, I'm gonna say the that the red. The red. Yeah, because that was the first thing I got. Okay, so this one is <laughs> I got this. This was the over obviously. It is the Red Ranger's helmet. This is absolutely gorgeous, absolutely wonderful, screen accurate, just oh, really a, a, a amazing, like amazing thing, like right here. It is absolutely. And in case you're wondering, oh, it's for display. I didn't even bring the display thing for it. No, this is more for more than display. Uh. This is for Dad knocking off the thing <laughs> at the beginning of the video, which is why I was like, Dad, come on, seriously. Wes? Yeah? Here. Help me out here. I'm going to guess there's one for every ranger, or? Uh, not currently. I don't know how well you can hear me. I can hear you. Okay. Uh, for you, don't forget up here, what? This has to push in. Which is why it's not going the best. There you go. And is this on? Is this okay? Yeah. yeah. Uh, right now it's only red. I'm expecting if they're going to do a second one soon, it'd probably be green. Because green is the most popular ranger. Tommy has always been the most popular. White, possibly, but there's a lot of gold on white. So, so bring it up close again. Bring it close up. Say something po Red Ranger-ish. It's morphin' time! Uh, his thing would have been Tyrannosaurus! Uh, this is excellent. It's fun to wear. I can see out of it. I'd totally be the star of the show if it wasn't for Tommy, God I can see out of it very well, actually. Like, it's not a long issue. I'm anymore in my glasses, too. So. Uh, but it's excellent. It's fun. You can wear um, it in the summertime. Yeah, yeah just wear it in the, in the summertime. Go on a leisurely stroll. Wes, help me out. Yeah. Oh, my God. It's Master the Red Ranger. <laughs> Well, Zordon said no one can know, so I'm going to have to kill everyone who's seen the video <laughs> and everyone who's around. Fun little fact, this can just go on Wes's head. Yeah, Put it, on. it just slides right on. So I think we know who the true Red Ranger is. <laughs> Fun fact. I'm very uh, small. My foot has went beyond asleep, and I can't feel it. Um, the final item, my prized possession, Whoa! My, absolute, <laughs> my absolute joy is... The Sabbath Saber. Um, this is excellent. This is like this is the first thing I bought. This is the thing that got me into collecting Power Rangers. I saw this and I knew I needed to have it. 
I knew instantaneously that I needed it. And this is really where it comes from. It's got lots of noises. It is, it's metal. It's hefty. It's very hefty. It's got a real good feel to it. Um, there's two different places where, like, you can press to make the noise. And this is Bring it up That's Jason David Frank, by the way. Is it really? Yeah. See, like... That's actually really cool. Huh. Can make him... I think. Let me see. That's really, really nice. Now br bring it up really close. Show the side. Show the side there. The side here, you can see the... Uh, the... So this is another Legacy edition, right? Oh yeah, this is the first Legacy thing I bought. It's so good, mm. it's so excellent. It's got a good feel to it. Um, most of these things usually do the power and just see them when you hold them long enough. I don't think this one does. Um, if it does, I can't remember how to do it. Yeah, we probably um, flagged it if we did too many bars. <laughs> that's true. But this mm. is it's so good. It's excellent. Um, it's probably my favorite thing in the Legacy line, with the exception of one thing that I don't have yet that I've been trying to get. I would have gotten it uh, recently, but it didn't uh, ship to here. My favorite thing that he does in this series with this is when he totally loses it and he cuts off all the putties' heads. <laughs> I mean, we can putties that can out. die. Like, that's fine. But, like, this is my this is my Power Rangers collection. There's some more stuff on the way, some more stuff at home. Like, I have a Power Rangers blanket that uh, we don't have here. Um, I have probably one of my favorite things in the thing. Now, one of these things well, I will note is that a lot of the stuff you see here is Mighty Morphin. And uh, that, for me, is an issue. Now, I like Mighty Morphin a lot, but I like the other series too. And I really want them, especially in the Legacy line, to move on to stuff like Zeo and uh, SPD and stuff like that. Yeah. I, I really would like to see. You can totally skip Turbo, though. <laughs> I would love to see this stuff. And it's not like people wouldn't buy them. I would love it too. Like, you notice the pops were all Mighty Morphin. That I would love to see some Zeo pops. Like, the Zeo Rangers look awesome. The SPD Rangers look awesome. RPM looks pretty good too. Like, I like the Samurai guy. By the way, feel this. Dad, feel that. That's like solid metal. That is solid metal. That is a solid, is really shiny solid metal. metal. I can see myself in that. Put up, put up those things. Like, so can, yeah, see that? You could find all the metal. It's really cool. It's so good. This is so nice. It has such detail. It's, like, excellent. The only thing... There's, there's one item in the Legacy line that I want so bad that I don't have yet. Uh, that is the Dragon Dagger. That's the only other thing that I think would, like, really hit, like, top. This is my prized possession. I like to say that the, the helmet is my prized possession. I've got some trouble getting through to the Red Ranger over there. <laughs> Did uh, you just, there was a cartoon I saw recently about the Power Rangers cartoon. And it's like, so it's a white ranger? And they're, and they're doing, and they're doing, have you seen that? No. And it's like, the, and they're going to do their, you know, like, you know, train the source rex. And the white ranger gets up. He's like, white power. <laughs> and I was like, whoa, 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 wait a minute. That's not cool. And he like does it like a couple times until they finally have to beat him up. <laughs> but this is, this is by far my favorite thing. Um, the helmet's really good too. Like, this is the majority of my collection. Uh, I have a couple of things. I got some stuff on the way. I got some Kamen Rider things on the way too. Now, when I went out to visit like Nova Scotia, uh, to uh, because that's the place we're looking to move. Uh, well, the kids will be visiting me there a lot. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. One of the things I saw there is something that uh, the map was kind of looking for. Yeah. So and uh, yeah, and which was it called again? It was the uh, Legacy. Limited edition black gold Megazord. Yeah, that's that's a, a rarity to find. So mm -hmm. we'll be, uh, you'll be looking at getting that when you come out, right? Yeah, definitely. So because the price was like, is good. It was it's good very price. good. Like, look at the uh, like, look at the detail on the eyes and that. It's really nice. That is really. It is really nice. That's a sexy piece. It's a damn sexy piece. And of course, like, you also got you for Christmas. Or, or no, for yeah. your birthday, right? For your birthday, I got you the. Uh, I get you the yeah. yeah it's got you the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers uh, box set. Box set for the TV the series. whole thing, uh, which is very nice. Which is still up uh, 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 right next to my TV. Now there was originally a uh, 
a full series set put out. Now that was before like Matt really got into it, and it had like a Red Ranger like like head. Fun and fact, by the way, um, the mold for this is taken from that. You can tell actually, uh, and and it, and it had all the series in it. Yeah. And uh, the thing with the Shout Factory, when you can buy the series on their own, but if you buy them in the uh, in in the big deluxe box sets, each one has like extra bonus discs. Like yours had bonus discs. If you just bought the series on their own, you'd miss out on the bonus disc sets. Yeah. So, uh, which is actually really, really cool. Kind of like when they did Get Smart, they did them with, and the, you could buy the series on their own, but the bonus discs are all taken out. <laughs> um, but there's four, right? What are you four sets. About? There's four Chef Factory sets. Yeah, yeah. Mighty Morphin sets. So if you guys are interested in like actually seeing like what spawned all this stuff, yeah. uh, Chef Factory put it four amazing deluxe sets. Uh, they're uh, they're fairly expensive. I had the first two, and I want to get the other two. So if if you wanna like see really what spawned all of this, get the Super Sentai. Cube Sentai. Cube Super Sentai. Like uh, the stuff that I have coming in the mail currently uh, isn't Power Rangers. It's Sentai. Really? Yeah. I've got a couple Sentai things that I didn't bring here. I've got some Sentai keys. I'm surprised you didn't bring your Sentai like DVD sets over as well. Mm, well, I was in a hurry. I was, I was in a bit of a hurry. Um, we thought we were in a hurry. <laughs> yeah, we were thought we were in a hurry. We waited outside for an hour. Wes, you want to go we grab my keys? Grab it so, so I can show that off. Because yeah, yeah, I'm the one who's got to talk throughout this. So, um, uh, I'll, I'll show a couple things. So I, I got a couple things here. Um, but, uh, while he's doing that, I'll, while he's doing that, I'll, uh, I'll tell you about, uh, what I got coming in the mail. Um, the, the main piece is, if you're caught up on the Sentai now, I've got the Q-Ranger Morpher coming. With a couple of the Q-Tamas. Which, uh, I'm really excited about. I'm really, really excited about that. I'm probably gonna start collecting the Q-Tamas, I'm gonna get those coming in. I might order, I'm not gonna order any... I have this thing where if I've ordered something of one of one thing, I wait until something's come in and then get more of it. Uh, I don't like to order in bulk, just per se. to make sure that you like it, or just to make sure that I like it and that everything's good with it. So it's like CD. Um, also that way, like I sort of extend the like the the things out. I've got all of uh, all of the Power Rangers from the movie it. on this thing. You can see that all the new Mario is used. Um, I've got th this thing's ah, cool looking. Uh, I've got lightning bolt symbol, and straight from Japan, I have two. Is that your finger? I thought, oh, do you have a, like a fake finger thing on there? Yeah, <laughs> I got a Matthew's fake finger. finger. <laughs> uh, I got uh, I got two of the Q Rangers. I've got orange and I've got gold. I've got uh, if you watch the series, which we'll see how many of you do, uh, Stinger and uh, oh god, Balance. Is that balance? Yeah, balance. Because uh, the other one's Naga. Singer and balance. I got Naga coming on the way. I actually have a second one of these uh, at home uh, by accident uh, because they're supposed to send me uh, silver, but they sent me gold again. Uh, so I was like, "Hey, you guys sent me ten bin gold when I needed uh, uh, Hibikata silver," and they're like, "Oh, sorry." And then I also ordered red, so red's coming too. So are they going to give it that for free then? Yeah, they just they're like, "It's fine. We'll send the other one." That's pretty cool. Though. Yeah, it's very nice. Uh, the people who send these to me actually send me additional things. That's why I have. Uh, I didn't bring it with me because it's on my like stand, but uh, I have a tiny samurai yellow like, like thingy from Japan. So it's uh, it's not samurai yellow. I don't remember what it would be. Shinken yellow. Yeah, Shinken yellow. Could be from Shinkenju. Uh, I got uh, Shinken green from uh, Shinkenju. Uh, the I used to have, I don't know where they are right now, because they got moved when I was up in Ontario. Um, but I had, like, I have a couple other morphers. I've got the two morphers from, uh, yeah, surprise from you Super Microphone. I don't know where they are right now, because they were moved. Um, they're probably somewhere in the living room, but I don't know, because... They put the keys, right? Yeah. Uh, but I also, <laughs> these, these things came with uh, keys from the Japanese version, which are much bigger and nice. cool. Uh, See, the morpher that, that he's talking about, actually... Had like keys for the yeah the, the Rangers. Uh, that would have been disappointing to bring as well because of the fact that uh, the battery mostly died pretty fast after I got it. Which sucks. <laughs> um, yeah, that was my collection. Um, now I have, I have a couple questions for you then. Yeah. Like out of all the Power Rangers series that that came out, 
What's your favorite? Um, I'm partial to RPM, and I'm very partial to SPD. So you like I, the three, like, uh, the abbreviations? The ones with the abbreviations there. Um, mm. SPD might win out a bit for me because of the fact that I really... Like, I like RPM's story, but the suits are kind of weird. Oh my god, it's scheduled to go into seat mode. Um, <laughs> no. Um, but, don't be at it! Hey! Um, but SPD, I like both the story and the uh, the suits. I love the SPD suits, probably my favorite. That's what I was going to ask you next, which, which suit? Yeah, it's SPD. Because they've got the, like, it's on one of the... Reach over here for this. So is Tommy your favorite ranger too? Would you consider him like your favorite out of all the series? Probably. Like Tommy's my favorite out of all the series when it comes to Rangers. Uh what's interesting is that like in the uh in the later ones, I guess in the right Nickelodeon uh Everybody. series is basically originally when it was Disney. like the Saban type thing. It ran like sixty five episodes, like yeah. type of thing. But Nickelodeon would break it up. Like uh like this the full series oh, yeah. in like two into uh two seasons. So, uh, you get like. They do that now. 20 to 25 episodes. Well, it's still it Saban. Up? It's still Saban, but yes. Yeah, well, Saban, this, here's the thing Saban's the one that does that. It's Saban, Nick, it's Saban with Nickelodeon that does that. That breaks it up? Yeah. Now, did Disney break it up and they did it? Or it's did be, it get no, to a smaller it's because the network that they're on yeah. only allows certain number of, uh, of episodes for any show, like a 20 something episode. So now they do it as one season, and then the super version of that season, where they'll add something in. That's why uh, Mega Force and Super Mega Force are two completely different series. Even and that's what, not. yeah. Well, no, they, they are. <laughs> that's the thing. Uh, Mega Force is. It's a great movie with Barry Boswick. <laughs> it's what am I? What is it? Again? Mega Force is Go Sager. Yeah. And Super Mega Force is Gokaiju. It's a completely different series. Like, it has nothing to do... This cast isn't the same. There's nothing to do with each other. I can put that in the hand there. Want me to do it? I can do it. Here you go. <laughs> uh, but, very careful stuff. But, uh... They break it up in a way that's, you know... I'll just keep these batteries... Those don't go in the bags because he's bigger. But uh, let's look at the, him again because he's he's excellent. Um, but yeah, this is this has been my collection. And so your favorite piece is actually the uh, would be the saber. Of course, of course it's the saber saber. Um, so Wes, have you ever watched Power Rangers the series? Mm, I um, have watched a bit of it. Yeah. And what did, what, which one did you see? The Mighty Morphin era, or? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, you watch it with me. Is Buff and Skull in it? Yeah. One of the things that was disappointing, um, is this playing about the film, is that they did not use uh, Buff and Skull. Yeah. Even as cameos, the actors, right? Because they really did have, like, if anybody had, a, had, like, were the, were the heart of the show and actually had a serious character progression, like, yeah. over, me, even over the Power Ranger actors themselves, the characters of Buff and Skull really do have a progression for the true. series. They started, you know, they're bullies, and they want to learn, like, to, uh, ba they basically want to learn martial arts at the beginning so they can beat people up. Yeah. Now they become, you know, they become big fans of the Power Rangers, kind of like Flash Thompson in the Spider-Man comics. Uh, the uh, the later on, uh, you know, they, they become uh, they become police officers. Uh, you know they I mean? they seem like kind of cowardly at first. They actually risk themselves to, uh, to help save the yeah. Power Rangers, and they even like learn the identity at one point, which gets like rep kind of, kind of mind wiped out of them later on in the, just, just in the second episode. To be but uh, because they did deserve it, and at the end when we last kind of like see. I guess uh, when we last really see them together, uh, and I think that's the Professor Proteus, something like that. The, you it's know, in Lost Galaxy, yeah. yeah when they're they, on Terra Venture. They actually like kind of like like they lead the charge. Oh yeah, that's like, at the end of it, space. Yeah, and uh, that's the thing. They they come in. Yeah. They, they lead and they the charge. continue. Some of them continue on after that. I think. Like Bulk, Bulk comes stays back after. Skull, Skull doesn't. Skull doesn't. Skull comes back once later on in Samurai, I think, because Bulk comes back in Samurai too. Uh, they come back a lot. I'm expecting to see them in the next film. Uh, I hope so. I would like to, at least, if not to see Balkan Skull, the characters, I would actually like to see the actors at least yeah. do a cameo. They do deserve that. They yeah. put a lot of time into it, more so than many of the actors that played on there. Like, if I was to say that, that they're actors that actually really put time into the uh, to the series itself, 
aside from the only one that they were in, the only series that they're in. Yeah. I say that Jason David Frank got to play Tommy, That's really true. did. And I say the guy that played Adam, uh, Johnny Young Bosch, also uh, did a, like, like came back to uh, yeah. then it really, really, you could see that they appreciated their uh, the show yeah. and the fans. Well, a lot, you know, a lot of actors go on and they're, they, you know, well, they're the Power Rangers and, you know. Yeah. But uh, they didn't. If you watch the series Eyes on Me on CW, actually, that the lead character of that actually started in the Power Rangers as well. Which one was that? Uh, uh, I'm, I'm not sure which uh, which which uh, Power Rangers series she was in now. Okay. But uh, if you if you watch that zombie, there's a Power Rangers. Uh, I didn't uh, I didn't bring them over. I didn't think about it because we're in a hurry. Uh, but uh, I also have the volumes of the comic book, which I really recommend. Boom Studios is the comic, right? Yup, okay. it's really good. It's much like the Puppet Master comic book series. It's everything I loved about that series. But without any of the like shitty parts of that series, <laughs> it's really good. So we got like so Boom Studios. They're the same guys that did the uh, the recent Hellraiser comic, the really good Hellraiser mm -hmm. comics. Where basically Pinhead actually gets to switch places out with uh yeah um, yeah. Well, read the Hellraiser Boom comics by the way if you haven't already, and read the Power Rangers ones where you get to learn about uh, it's currently going into more the origins of the Green Power Coin, where that came from. And they're facing off against a evil, uh, evil ranger called uh, Lord Dracon, who controls the Black Dragon Uh which is really cool. Uh, it takes place; the comic book takes place right after uh, Green with Evil, and goes from there. And you learn some really interesting facts, like uh, Tommy wasn't the first person offered the green coin. Yeah, but I had to turn it down. Ha. Uh, actually, the person who was after the green coin would surprise you. Who? It was Zach. Zach? Mm hmm Zach's always been second in command. And he, like, Rita saw that he, like, he, uh, he sort of wanted, like, he felt, like, second fiddle to him a bit. Nobody's nobody's really paying attention to my hip hop moves, and it, it's actually it's actually cool because like you get to see one the tension between uh, Zach and Tommy because Zach doesn't immediately trust him, especially because as we found out with him being offered the thing, what they didn't know is that he was offered the thing and told Zordon about it, but they kept it secret. Ah, oh. uh, so there's a lot of cool stuff to it. Um, they're doing another series too. They just announced recently called Go Go Power Rangers. Which is actually set after the first episode and gets into uh, more of the backstory because uh, Mighty Morphin is very Tommy focused. This okay. is going to be very like like different characters. origins of. Uh, it's kind of like a Legends of Dark Knight type of thing, right? Yeah, it's going to be a lot about that. You're going to find out that uh, one of the things I mentioned is that Bolt and Skull actually used to be good friends with Billy, and there was actually a sixth member of their friend group that just never uh, never got powers, and it's apparently going to lead. Further into things, so I'm not going to be evil character. I'm not going to be surprised. Yeah. Um, but, so why has, has there not been comics yet done for the other uh, Morning Mighty Morphin series? Because for I me, mean, the other series, yeah. Yeah, because the other shows like where they didn't last sometimes as long. Yeah. Uh, it would be nice to see, especially like the ones like in space and yeah, uh, like there where there's kind I think of a it's mythos because there. everybody like everybody like, knows. The Mighty Morphin. Mighty Morphin. And I know, but like, maybe some offshoots or you know, maybe some one-shots or some Forge miniseries. No, I agree. Something to kind of flesh it out will be really nice. I agree. Especially but the, with the movie. What, I, what, so well. what we need is the Zeo Crystal was introduced in the movie. Yeah. We need to go further with that. I, I, I want to see changes in the suits. They said that they're changes. They've got, what's it going to like? They've already got six films planned. I'm expecting Zed to be in the next one. Oh, 100%. There's no way. Like Zed is like Zed was the creation of the uh, was it was not in the Japanese uh, like uh, Sentai. Zed was a, was actually a North American creation, uh, completely, like, and it's a very cool looking suit. Well, I can see Zed the actor in. that voiced Lord Zed. Uh, you actually pretty much walked by the actor that voiced Lord Zed. Did I? Yeah, he was in uh, here in St. John's. What was those like one early years, right? Yeah, basically. Okay, one well, well that was before I knew. You know, but he was like he's. Pretty laid back, chill dude. Uh, but uh, <clears throat> it's such a cool like sculpt. 
like yeah. the Lord's Dead costume. So it'll be nice excellent. to see what the what a modern day version of that's going to look like. You oh really don't need to change a lot to because it's already a scary looking. It was scary. It really is. Like he's a fierce looking like guy. That's why they like kind of reined the character back a bit because the character's yeah. like Scott was actually so scary that they were worried. They made him a bit more comical him. later. Yeah. And and there's a reason to. He's a skinless man in perfectly silver freaky armor yeah. with like bane like venom like things yeah. going all up his body. He I like is he's like Zord like uh, his head like Yeah, his head staff? Yeah. He's excellent. Uh he's cool and I he's definitely going to be the villain in the next one. Um without a doubt like he'll be the villain like do you think they'll ever go into like the machine like nation type machine thing? I mean, well they have to they've got six film clients yeah um they, they could just go with their own like do original like, you know they those, could well. but they're gonna want to do that like scorpina i'm assuming will like appear as probably like a side person too well no was scorpina the one that was the girl was like was like she was either sick i don't know if she was sick she was having the baby or something like that so all of her scenes were filmed originally by uh by Mariska Hargitay from La and Order S for You. So you can actually find it online. Like, Or is that or is that another character? I think that was Diva Tox. That, you're right, that is Diva Tox. And the, um, then, the, but then they had the original actress back, so they actually had her do all the scenes. I would have loved to see, like I see the pictures online of Mariska Hargitay, because I have a crush on her <laughs> from La and Order. And, uh, and uh, would it would be nice to see her in that. Episode. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, Lord Zed will probably be the next villain, and then we'll see where it goes from there. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if Rita was back to some degree. I mean, so I'm guessing I'll kill her off. Then I'll go. I won't, won't go. We'll go too far. I'll go too right far into it. But there's there's <clears throat> something near the end that uh, if you're a fan of Power Rangers, you're definitely gonna get the reference, and you'd be like, okay. Uh, you still haven't seen the movie. Do you have it down? No, I want to see it. I want to okay. actually see. It. I don't want to like. It's not something like I could go through nefarious means to uh, to watch the film. But it's uh, I miss the uh, the theater showing of it. So for me right now, that that's the Blu-ray showing because it's a movie that I am really really interested in seeing. Yeah, I'm kind of I really want to talk about it. If there's like an yeah. extended edition of it, oh uh, man, if there's an extended edition, I'll have it because that's that's definitely what I want. I, I will get, grab that for sure. Uh, if it's if it's in before you guys go and stuff, yeah. I'll show off the stuff that's coming in the mail. We'll see. I got, uh... I could have showed my Power Rangers box this time I had here, but like, they're all ready packed. Yeah, they're all packed. Um, because I've got the, the Sentai Kyutama thing coming from, the Q, uh, Q Ranger Morpher, uh, which is awesome. And I've got, uh, the belt from Kamen Rider Double. Is there either Morphin, like, either Sentai that you would, you would not see done here? Like... Like, are you, like are you asking me ones that won't be done here or ones that I don't want to see done? Here? That, no, that won't, that won't be done. Like, that one? Maybe the suits look, like, awkward now or... Like, um, ones that won't be done here. Well, anything, obviously, before, uh, Mighty Morphin, which is actually sad to some degree because I would love to see... Show Factory started doing their sets, like, after, like, they, the Mighty They did it with Mighty Morphin, Morphin and after, but yeah. there's some ones before that I would love to see. There's only six out right now. There's so... Did you... Like... Jew Ranger is the 16th season yeah. of that. There's there's 15 other seasons before, and I want to see them. Like, and I it's still see, ongoing. It's not a show that's ended since then. No, it's, it's not ongoing. at all. That's I'm I'm watching the new season. It's really good. Um, that one's not going to be done. Uh, anything before that's not going to be done, I mean. Um, Die Ranger, they had a chance to do it. The closest that you can get to Die Ranger is this. He's from Die Ranger. Uh, they didn't do the other... Die Ranger! Oh. Uh, uh, they didn't do the rest of his stuff. They actually have really cool suits. They look very similar to this. Um, they have... I don't know why they didn't just make him, like, the green Die Ranger, because there was already a green... Whatever. <laughs> um, uh, you will not see... Uh, there's a couple ones, we think. Um, you won't see... Go Busters, even though I love Go Busters, which was a more of a secret agent oriented one, where they had more like tied down suits that were like, like they were like, fits. No, it was it was more like secret agent. So like there was like the red here, but like like more like army like pants oriented things, and they had like stuff and two. Of... It was like really nice, and like their visors were actually instead of being red, they were the color that they were, but they were like like reflective and stuff. It was pretty cool. Um, you won't see. 
Goanger, I think it is, which is the train one. That's too bad. That, that sounds, that sounds cool, actually. Is it Goanger? It's not Goanger, is it? Who's that? Uh, is it Cinema Sickness, the, uh, the YouTuber that really likes trains? He would totally. Uh, <laughs> that's like the um, because he's like, you know, he does. He's like the, train. the train ones had a weird gimmick that would be hard to do, especially here, which is that they could change colors. Oh, nice. Yeah, they could be each other's colors and they could use their abilities. Um, it was pretty cool. There was a bunch of them. I didn't like the costume too, too much. They had, like, train tracks over their visors. It was a bit <laughs> weird. Um, Tom Satangan. Also, um, look up their... Look up their Megazord. Because there's a reason. There's a hefty reason. I'm not going to show it here. You guys can look it up and you'll understand. I'm just trying to remember the name of it. Um... Is that the one that has, like, a... Yeah, because the, there's a train coming out of it, but uh, where it's coming out of it... Yeah, it's, uh... It's an almost not safe for work Power Rangers sword. Uh, like... It's it's not... Let's see if I can find it. Just images. Images, yes. It's, like... It's like a different one. But we should. We got an over an hour yeah. long it's video. So at this point, we're probably not going to do an after credit sequence. We're, no, we're probably not going to do an after credit <clears throat> sequence. Uh, you also won't see... Uh, what's the word? Um, Zoo Ogre, the, the Sentai that was before this last one. Uh, because, well, first off, because... It's garbage. You might. It's just the costumes are terrible. The things are. Can we use that the costumes there? Yeah, these are the costumes. Yeah. Oh, let's see. They don't look that bad. They're bad. They look like Party City costumes. They're simple. So show up before. Sorry. Show up there. Um, it's not showing it. at all. No, because this is on my phone. It's going to be hard to see. Do you see that glare? That's... Let's see if I can turn down the brightness. This doesn't even. No. Let me see. Maybe if I can do it from a different angle. Yeah. Well, you see, you Would see you that like glare. Would you like to be blinded? <laughs> <laughs> is that what you want? What is it called? It's called uh, Zoo Ogre. Okay. Hold on a second, guys. I'm actually going to spell it. Uh. Uh. Z. Y. U. Capital O. H G E R. Zoo Ogre. Or Zoo Ogre. I don't know how to pronounce that one. So is this them right there? Um. Let me see. So. Yeah, they look like Party City suits. <laughs> that's not bad. So that's the suits right there, guys. They look like Party City suits. You should, honest. Look at their Instinct Awakens form. It's like, holy crap. <laughs> All right, so thank you guys so much for start watching the the Matt Cedric Power Rangers. This I'm trying to remember the name of the Super Sound. The what is it? Tokyuger. Tokyuger. That's the name of the train one. Tokyuger. I knew there was a capital letter in it. It's a capital Q. Um, What's it called again? Tokyuger. Spell it. T O capital Q G. H E R. So we'll show you the Takuga Zord. Uh. Oh my god, is that for real? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I, I sent this picture to someone recently. <laughs> I this This is a Takuga Zord and it's just This might be the reason why, why it's not going to be on uh, on any muddy. I don't know why they skipped part. this one. I <laughs> So, it's so wonderful. It's it has a train, and, and it's no. This is not a mock up or anything like that. Tokyo sword. Look, I don't know why they skipped it. <laughs> so it, this is not a mock up. It's not a. It's not a fake. That actually was the way that it looked. Uh, they, now to be uh, fair, I'm sure they took it very innocently. They didn't even think anything of it like that. But oh my God! Come on, guys. <laughs> so there you go. You're missing out on that. You're also missing out on bazookas that stop shot trains. So. <laughs> right. So, you want to do your ending thing? 
This is yours. It's hard to do uh, an ending here. Usually you do your It's Time for Tea thing. For me... Oh my god, it really is time for tea. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just like tea tea. Yes. Just like tea tea. Um, I'm going to go have Pogos now. Because <laughs> I'm hungry. Because it's been an hour of me talking. How would you um, have Pogos? Uh, for those of you who don't know, which is actually everyone, I have had a massive pounding headache for this entire video. So Aww. I'm going to probably have, like, a good lay down with my <laughs> eyes closed. Uh, <laughs> All right. I've had a bit of a headache myself, too. Um, and I'm going to prepare for Injustice 2. Uh, which I'm very, very excited about. Let's hope that, even though I know, I think Ed Boon said he wasn't going to do it, a Power Ranger DLC. Because I think that they should be, to be honest. That would be cool. They are cool. they are superheroes, so... Yeah, it, that's No fact. reason to not. Um, stay cool. So what time is it now? It's morphin time. With well, a little bit more conviction, Dad. It's morphin' time. <laughs> <laughs> what time is it, Eeyore? It's, it's morphin' time. time. You said that weirdly perversely, Father. <laughs> no, that's not That's perversely. not Eeyore. Like, Eeyore, Eeyore would be like, It's morphin' time. You were like, It's morphin' time. <laughs> Hello. There we go. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been the Print Chronicles Chapter 3. Uh, we got Wes over there with a headache. Who's going to be lying down. Matt's going to be doing the pogos. Yeah. <laughs> doing the pogos, you know. Yeah, no, eating pogos, you know. Dad, ah. stop. And I'm, and I'm going to be stop, grabbing buddy. some tea because for me right now, it is time for some morphorific. Dad joked. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. <laughs> yeah. Ay, ay, ay. So, Alpha, get five teenagers with absolutely no attitude. <laughs> it's called abduction. Hi there. This is our after credit sequence. Hey, that's what this is. <laughs> it is totally our after credit sequence. We are not trying to pad it out and put in an after credit sequence even when we, with when with no thought or any like planning or even anything in there. Uh, this is totally super very much our after credit sequence. We really prepared this room. Really not well. on my phone or anything. No, it's it is it is very centric that we have this in here. This could not have gone on without this after credit sequence. This is in it's, it's instrumental. Honestly, like the after credit sequences to end all after credit sequences, huh. it's so fundamental and vital. This was such a vital after credit sequence that I heard that Guardians of the Galaxy wanted to use this here after credit sequence. They had five. This they would have been six. Was pushing it, so they just didn't yeah. have it. And this would have been like too much. They th they said, "Look, don't we need it for uh, Infinity War?" And they said, "Yes," but. But we we just can't like we've got too many. So we d we decided that we'd use it here instead. Yeah. So there we go. We we thought it was too good to be not used. This is the most after credit se credit sequence that we've ever done. Disney gave us the go ahead. They did. Thanos was supposed to be here, but we didn't have yeah. But uh, but this is the best one. Yep, definitely is. Uh, <laughs> it's totally planned. We scripted this one out. Like, With, like five writers went over this. The last couple weeks we've been like working on this. There's been a couple drafts of this one, but it's. I think it's, this is the best. It's pretty. Uh, definitely. It's, it's, it's definitely an after credit sequence. <laughs> it's, it was 100 percent like top of the line, honestly. For a while there. It is. I, mean, I need tea. Yeah. You, you need pogos. I need pogos. And by me, he means not not the stick, but like the actual like the pogos that you eat. Yeah. Just in case, I was like somebody's thinking, was gonna, is he gonna is he gonna go and get out a pogo? I'm gonna go buy a pogo stick. <laughs> Jumping around, like <laughs> mm, I'm just gonna no, go buy no. a pogo stick. I think I, that had to be clarified. I think that that's another important. Yeah, question. this is a like lot people of were these, questions that had to be answered. It's too ambiguous. We need that's why the after credit scene sequence was needed because we said pogos in the main video. We didn't clarify that I was eating uh, pogos, the hot dog, the corn dog, and stick. And you're not actually Spider-Man, you're just wearing the shirt. No, I'm just wearing the shirt. Uh, I did go to a convention once uh, with this shirt on, and someone stopped me 
It was like, like a couple people sent me. It was Superior yeah. Spider-Man that talked to me about it. That comic sucked ass. <laughs> no, it wasn't really bad, but um, no, it was pretty cool. But uh, but people talked to me about it, and I was like, okay. And and just you know, so that's not that. Although I have a huge <laughs> beard and a checkered shirt, I'm not actually a lumberjack. Or Dexter. Or Dexter. Well. <laughs> <laughs> We'll just there, leave there it right there. Oh, there's the after credits like hook for the next one. Is he Dexter? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Most definitely not. Uh, but who knows? Man, Justice Two is coming out. I just want it right now. It has to be Tuesday. I'm just, I want it to be Tuesday. And all of a sudden, because we're on an island, new plan. I'll see if they'll get it here. No, like, like, like I'm sure they probably already have it. I'm gonna like bug them to like tomorrow. Not tomorrow. Could I have it early? I'm gonna bug them on Monday because they know me there and be like, <laughs> I spent all of my money on Power Rangers. I spent I I bought everything they own Power Rangers. They should they they have hundreds of dollars of my money in Power Rangers. Like you saw those, I have, all those pops came from, from there. Every one of them. Every single one of them. The the stuffed stuff, the Matryoshka dolls. Uh, a hey. couple of those figures, they bought me. Justice too. <laughs> it's perfect after credit sequence.